Hey YouTube, it's Ashley, back again for another thrift haul. And as you can see, it is Thai Tuesday uh, that I'm filming on. Who knows what day of the week I'll end up uh, posting this video on, because I have several other videos waiting to be posted. Um, but I wanted to come back with you, uh, to you, with another thrift haul. Um, this one is a Goodwill thrift haul. So uh, the day that I went to the Goodwill, and this Goodwill was actually in New Hampshire, it was half off of all pink tag items. So I will go ahead and show you all the sale items first, the pink tag items, and then go into all the regular priced items, ending with the things that I had liked best. So I will just go ahead and get started. So um, I'll start with the t-shirts. And these were the least expensive items. They were regularly $2.99 or $3. So all pink tags were just $1.50. So the first t-shirt is this really pretty Star Wars t-shirt. And I'm not like a huge Star Wars person. I definitely like the Star Wars movies. But I just thought this print was really, really pretty. Um, with the black and white and the red roses. And for $1.50, it's just a really cute t-shirt to have. And then um, this one, you guys will probably remember from one of my first videos. Um, I mentioned that my boyfriend is really obsessed with Jeeps. So when I saw this t-shirt, I had to grab it. And he was actually with me this time. And this one actually has, um, you can see, like, fake dirt on it. Coming up from the tires of the Jeep. So I thought that was really adorable. So that one was $1.50 as well. And then um, regular shirts, like button-ups and blouses, all of those shirts were $4.99. So I found this shirt, which has like the um, almost like faux tie at the collar that you can tie in a bow or leave untied, however you want to wear it. Um, and then it's just like a semi-sheer button-up. And it's got this really pretty um, flower pattern with almost like feathers as well. Uh, with lavender and teal and white. And I just thought this would be a really nice addition to my spring and summer wardrobe that I've just changed my closet over to finally. Now that we've got some warmer weather. And then the last for my half off items are these really nice navy blue corduroys from J. Crew. And these one are, I believe, yep, the matchstick corduroys. So they're the um, straight leg, or um, not straight leg. I always call them straight leg because I'm so used to like vintage or um, older style jeans, but they're the skinny leg. And these were half off of $7.99, so those were $4. And then first of my not half off items, I found this t-shirt. And it's darker on the top and then basically ombre going down. And uh, this shade of turquoise is one of my favorite colors. And it's just got a really tiny pocket on it. And this t-shirt is from The Gap, so it's $3. And then uh, this shirt was with the blouses uh, for $4.99. And another one of my favorite colors to wear, uh, mustard. And this is just an Ann Taylor Loft shirt. And then another um, shirt, $4.99. This one is from New York and Company, and I've really been on the hunt for a plain black button-up shirt because for some reason um, I do not have one. I have like every other color possible of a button-up shirt, but not just solid black. So it is just solid black, um, but it is really long. So it is like tunic length, and then in the back it ties. And it does have um, a dry cleaning label on it. Someone got it dry cleaned. And then the last um, shirt I got for $4.99 was this really pretty 
um, button up with the ruffling. This one is from J. Crew, and it is a light gray with white pinstripe. And actually, I'm sorry, that one was $5.99. Um, anytime they're different prices from what section they're in, they actually tag them separately. And uh, this one was more expensive as well because it still has the brand new tag on it from J. Crew. And this one I thought was so nice. It is really, really soft flannel. And I liked the colors also. Otherwise, um, there really was no way I was spending $7.99 on a shirt. Uh, even on a pair of pants sometimes I won't spend $7.99, but um, I thought this was really nice. It's brand new. Like I said, super soft. But $7.99 for that shirt from J. Crew. And then last but not least, um, this was probably the first thing that I found when I was there. And um, I was really excited. I was kind of frustrated when I first got to the store because I went and looked at the shoes first, which is usually one of the first things that I look at when I go there because I know that if there's, um, you know, a sale going on that, you know, there's usually not too many pairs of shoes. Like there are, you know, pants, tops, whatever. And um, there's always people in the shoe aisles and shoes are going to go fast. So I went in one of the shoe aisles and um, I was trying to look at my size and there were like three people all from like the same family, a mom, the daughter, and like the aunt or sister, whatever. And they were all sitting in this aisle. Like the woman was with her carriage, sitting down, trying on shoes, taking up like the entire aisle because they were just really small aisles. So I couldn't look at basically any of the shoes all on one side. So I tried to be like subtle about like trying to look at them, you know, next to her and behind her and she just was not moving. And these shoes were actually completely behind her. So when she got up to like grab another pair of shoes or do something, I just reached behind her and grabbed them because I was like, I'm not having this lady grab these shoes instead of me. So <laughs> hopefully she wasn't going for them anyway, but, um, these um, just small heeled loafers, they are leather and um, you can probably just barely see it because it's in gold. They are Ralph Lauren um, and maybe you can see it on the bottom. The bottoms are a little beat up but they're leather sold so they do get wear pretty easily there. But yeah, you can probably see the um, name backwards because I'm filming on my computer, but um, yeah, and these were $5.99. They were a gray tag, so they weren't half off, but yeah, I just thought these were really, really gorgeous with a little tassel. So yeah, these were the last item that I picked up at Goodwill. Um, all in all, I thought it was a pretty good trip. Um, definitely spent a little more than I planned to. Um, I also got like a little laundry basket, uh, basically just to transport my clothes back and forth from my closet because my big laundry basket always seems to just be full of clean clothes that I bring into my closet, um, that I bring off the drying rack if they're delicates or um, that come out of the dryer or whatever. So it just ends up being in my closet all of the time so I can't use it to transport clothes back and forth. So yeah, I got a laundry basket too for $2.99. And I just need to actually disinfect that and clean that out before I start using it. But other than that, that was it. Um, again, if you've made it through this video, uh, I was just looking down to check the time to make sure I'm still within the time limit. But uh, thanks for watching. Uh, again, if you have any suggestions for other types of videos that you'd like to see or have any comments, um, would like to see more, please like, comment, subscribe. And... Thanks again for watching. Bye.